Hello, 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 everybody, and welcome back to another Gaming on Caffeine live stream and another episode of Cuboid Outpost. Hey, hello, oh, Nick. Welcome, 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 welcome. welcome. Oh, it is uh, Christmas Eve here it Nick, is. On, Merry the, Christmas on the Cuboid Eve. Outpost. My goodness. Um, I'm going to sleep, man, because then it'll be Christmas Day, right? Yeah, exactly, man. We want to just, oh. you know, fast forward. Oh, there Merry Christmas. Oh. Merry Beautiful. Christmas, Isaac. Look, I've got you a present. Oh! Yeah, oh, it's, you out, have it's out this. here. It's uh, some basalt and blackstone pebbles. Wow. Yeah, just, I collected these pebbles just, for you, man. Um, just what I wanted, man. Just, I went just, to the beach. <laughs> just what I wanted. I went to the beach and got these just for you. Well, Are you happy with um, that? I mean, yeah. I'm, ooh, yeah, I'm, yeah, 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 yeah. Just mm, that yeah. beach full of white stone, man. And I, wow. I, I actually trawled through to find the those small little pieces of black stone within mm. it. Yeah, no, um, I, I, I mm, yeah, I really, I, 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 I can't, I can't even put into words, Nick, how much I appreciate it. Yeah, you could take one of these and use it as a pet, pet rock. Man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you ever had yeah. a pet rock? Isaac? I love pet rocks, man. They're the best what? kind of of pets. Um, what the actual hell is this? Type in pet space R O into your J I Isaac, and look at the second thing across. Yeah, a standard uh, voodoo pop uh, puppet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, <coughs> the voodoo <coughs> puppet is fine. I don't, I don't, don't take any issue with that. It's the texture that I'm interested in. Oh, yeah. I really want to imagine you can place that down in it and it takes I, that pose. I believe you can, man. Oh my goodness. Oh, right. As soon as we've got Graves Dust and a gas tier. I don't know if you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You don't need a gas tier. You just need dead bush, leather, string, clay, and then some Graves Dust. Oh, yeah. Where the, what, what the hell is the Graves Dust? We've got two. I believe you get it from killing mobs, Nick. Oh, right. Wow. I know what's on the agenda <laughs> for, 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 for some point. It says it yeah. allows you to prevent certain types of death, man. So, I mean, that could be useful, you know? Yeah, man. I mean, I would get involved. I would get involved. In fact, Isaac, you actually mentioned before we started that uh, you want to kind of create a mob farm style thing, right? So, like, you could even create a mob farm. And just, you know, if you ever need to enter it for whatever reason to maybe pick up some bits or something, Isaac, you can take your voodoo doll, put it down. The mobs will get scared. They'll say, ah, ah, it's a voodoo doll. And then they'll and then they'll disappear and you'll be fine. You won't die, Isaac. That's how it works, right? I, I think so. Yeah, I think that's correct. Yeah, yeah. I think legally speaking, that's that's right. Yeah. Yeah, I thought um, it would be. I do have a question for you, Nick. Hi. And that question is, how tall is too tall for this lava tank? Um, 256, seven blocks, Isaac. Is 257 too tall. blocks is yeah, too tall. Because then that's actually too tall. You can't Physically do too that. tall, right. Yeah, okay. yeah, Anything yeah. below that, though, is, is legal. Is fine. Right. Man, it, I want to see a skyscraper tank, Isaac. That's right. what I want to see. All so right. Anything, anything below that amount is, is street legal. Exactly. What, what, uh, why level are we at now? We are at Y level, uh, 72. Isaac. So 72 take away 256. Uh do 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 two it's 184, right? So 184 blocks tall is your um is your upper limit, Isaac. Okay. I'm Anything being told, up to that is fine. <laughs> I'm being told by the Twitch chat there's a 32 block height limit to the tank, which uh, um unfortunately does put a damper right on, on, on our, our, our dreams. Plans. Yeah, exactly. Right. That's quite annoying. Um but we I can can't still lie. go Real freaking big, man. Yeah. 32 is pretty sizable, man. Can't That's lie. true. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what um, I'm currently at, but it's freaking tall, man. This yeah, thing can currently hold 864,000 millibuckets. So, right. I mean, oh, my goodness. It's yeah, that, that's a lot. And it's, it's max width and height is three by three, right? So, we can build a max tank, hopefully. Oh, Isaac. definitely, Nick. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 100%. This, this is what I, it's what I want to see, man. We've got, last see. stream, Nick, we set up alternate copper. We even put the copper in storage drawers, man, so that, in compacting drawers even, so they're available in nugget form now without having to craft yeah. it, which is perfect. And yeah, we've got glass, we've got sand, everything is is just A-OK. -okay, it's, it's, -okay. it's, all, it's all happening. All right, cool. Um, while, I, uh, while I pointlessly extend the height of this tank, Nick, what are you, uh, what are you working on, man? Um, so I was working through the mechanism quest, um, but since you're, you know, increasing the height of our 
structures, Isaac, and for general access to things, um, it's probably a good idea to make a jetpack, right? Ooh, so let's uh, let's jetpacks. have a look at, at, at these, um, the, what the pack has to offer. So we've got the classic mechanism ones, um, and then also the iron jetpacks mod ones. Um, question. Yes. The iron jetpack mod, is it made by the same creator as uh, the iron chest mod i don't think so okay because if it was i was re i was ready to just go all in with this because uh, i don't have i don't have the i don't have that those stats on hand right i see okay like but this maybe? is this is fine i just the only real thing that i actually need is is leather um, mm, which is tricky right yeah, because we were trying uh, to get leather at the end of the last stream, and we kind of ran into this uh, this problem, Nick, of not being able to kill enough zombies, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I only need six, to be fair, for jetpacks for both of us, and I already have two rotten flesh, so it's not too far. The alternative is the mechanism jetpacks. Mm. Let's have a look. So Which they I think are, are worse. Are they worse? Okay, they in that case... Yeah, I think they're worse in almost every way. They're unupgradable, and they are also... Yeah. Uh, like, they require hydrogen, so we'd have to get an electrolytic uh, separator and yeah. a limited water Ooh. source, and then they're Ooh. not very good, and yeah. That's crap, to be it's, honest. It's not great, yeah. Yeah, no, that's that's complete and utter garbage, Isaac, as mm. far as I'm concerned. Garbage, so I'll make yeah, these yeah. ones. We actually do have enough rotten flesh to make um, the jetpacks. Like, that's fine. Oh, nice. Um, Oh, we do we do dry these, don't we, in the drying cupboards? Is, is that the this the 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 leather making situation here? That's no, no, like... you just smelt them in the redstone furnace. The new oh, one that is now over on the far side. It's by the drying cupboard, though. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Here we go. Right, so I need to smelt six. So here we go. Why you do that? You have you have tugged Nick on a on a little. You snagged. You've you've I've you've, snagged. You've snagged on a little string. Nick, and that, that string is that we don't have a mob farm or a way of getting, m like, um, mob drops easily currently, right? Right. So I think what I should do real quick is begin work towards some kind of mob farming system, right? Okay, cool. Yes, yes. That, that would be very useful so that we don't have to, you know, take our swords out in the, in the midst of the night and, yeah, you know... Our swords. Yeah, our swords and you know, swords. cross our swords against some zombies and you know, acquire rotten flesh that way. Similar with uh, skeletons, we don't want to be you know, class crossing our swords with any of their bones. Mm -hmm. Um, obviously, and just generally, man, um, it would be much better if we didn't have to, didn't have to do that. Uh, okay. I also did not realize that it's it's four rotten flesh equals one leather. That's yeah. This, but yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. Right. So I am, I'll be a little bit down, but not too down. Okay. Um, I will need two more leather or like, uh, like nine more rotten flesh. So I think that's, that should be fine. Um, yeah. Is we could seven i need seven more we've got flesh. nick we've got like Hi. a staggering amount of dirt basically yeah. infinite, right and we have grass yeah. seeds we could yeah. begin the grassification of the the fenced zone and in doing so could potentially cook like a few cows to spawn oh yeah local, you know fresh organic produce and yeah, all and that means our leather problem is actually sorted yeah through that and also yeah. man, freaking you know a quick little rib of beef for christmas as well like you oh know, yeah don't get me, you know. Oof. Yeah, well, actually, <laughs> further to our conversation of Christmas dinners yesterday, I was informed this morning that my family has required beef as part of the Christmas dinner this year well, as well. Yeah, we're also having beef, man. It's good yeah. stuff. I, yeah, I've never had it Christmas dinner, Isaac. <laughs> that like, doesn't surprise me, man. You had ribs. some slices of roast beef. You, you had ribs for the first time, like, last week, you know? So yeah, you know what? I actually had ribs last week, Isaac. Yo. I had it this week, actually, while I was on my staycation. I was in a pub. And we had a a, a platter board, and no. on it was ribs. And I had the ribs, Isaac. They were pretty good. Nice. I, I stand by the fact that I wouldn't ever really crave them. Yeah. Um, I don't think I ever crave ribs, but you see them yeah. on the menu, you're like, oh, I could go for some ribs. Yeah. See, see, I'm still all about the fried chicken, man. However, mm. however, um, I did think they were pretty good. I was, I saw them. I was like, oh, I'll have some of those because it's like a running joke on YouTube that I, I, like, have never had ribs ever. Yeah. So, 
Yeah, they were pretty good. Um, they were. How many? How many barbecued. stars out of out of out of five? Um, maybe like three point five. Three point five out of five stars. Okay. It's not like I'm not. Uh, I'm not seeing its praises, but yeah, it was definitely not, fine. Mm, right. right. You're not actively trying to seek out more ribs as we speak. Mm, exactly. Mm. Exactly, Isaac. Yes. Yeah. So I'm I not understand. like I don't see a cow when I'm you driving don't... on the motorway <laughs> on the sides, and I just have like <laughs> automatically see a, an X-ray vision of its ribs, and like, oh yeah, <laughs> give you some of those ribs. Like tonight, I need to order some food, Isaac, because I've run out of food. Um, and I, I've not, I've decided on not ribs actually. Right. I, I, oh, you I, mean like, okay. You mean like you're ordering food as in like to be delivered. To be cooked. delivered to my, to cooked to my cooked door. Cooked and delivered. Right. I understand. Cooked and delivered. Right. Isaac. Right. Exactly. Right. Exactly. Understand. So, um, I have, I, I was like, oh yeah, I could go for a burger. And it did cross my mind. It's like, sh I could get some ribs. I was like, nah. I'm not See, having any wow. ribs. So that's like a that's ribs. like a glowing anti endorsement for ribs, right? You're, kind you've, of. You've really gone. But then again, you had them recently, so you know maybe maybe not. Yeah, I got. I've had my fair share of ribs recently, man. Wow. Yeah, yeah. I actually had pizza like I had Domino's. I have had pizza quite recently, but I've had, I had a Domino's for the first time in ages. Mm. Um, the other day. How was that? And uh, it it definitely hits a spot. That's what I've realised. <laughs> Like, that <clears throat> normal other pizzas don't tend to hit, even, like, really nice, like, Italian ones, right, that are supposed to be, like, very authentic. Like, they they definitely hit a spot. Um, is however... This a, is this an ad? <laughs> uh, <laughs> it should be. I missed the, uh, I missed the Domino's uh, sponsorship you email. You didn't see those I emails? Think, I, don't think that, I don't think the money's gone into my account yet, Nick. I don't oh, think we damn. can. Don't Maybe we, can. we should. Yeah, we've, got, we've sent them the invoice, Isaac. They're not bloody oh. paid up. Oh, for God's sake. Mm, well, just to, just to be safe, I'm going to say Domino's is garbage. I don't okay, think cool. that necessarily, we'll but just to cancel each other out. We'll yeah, cancel yeah, each yeah. other out, yeah. Uh, what's that stupid slogan that they've got now? It's so dumb. Oh no! It uh, it used to be the official food of everything, but now yes. it's Domino Yoohoo or something stupid <laughs> like that. Like it's um, honestly, honestly makes me angry. Isaac. <laughs> it makes me so upset. Makes me angry. Wow. Oh, unreal. That's that's. that's... You should uh, you should talk to someone about that. Yeah, man. I, think I, I think I should as well, man. <laughs> oh dear. Here we oh. go. Right. So if I just. Chop this enrichment chamber off the uh, off the wall here. Here we go. Chop a, it off. Just chop it right off. That's a quest complete. There we go. Nice. Okay. I have uh, begun this grass platform. Okay. Cool. 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 A uh, PSA, Isaac. Mm. When it turns night, don't sleep. Oh. Okay. Um, so I can acquire my seven rotten flesh. For these jetpacks, and once I've got that, I can go pretty quickly from through the tears, just through the tears, through. pretty much straight to diamond. I think because we've got well, all of the... the. While you work on that, then I might look at getting the emerald singularity if that's possible. Oh yeah, yeah, that would be that because be very then we good. can, you know, we can feed all of the birds with all of the scones, right? Exactly, exactly. That would exactly. be excellent, yeah. Isaac. Like that we have a excellent. we have a, a gravel singularity, right? Uh, we do, yeah, it's downstairs, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so all I have, and you don't have to go downstairs now, man, because it's just in the system, right? It's in the system, yeah. 21 so I, yeah. something for all of those singularities, and 15 presents as well, uh, 15 oak chests from Quark. This must have changed today, then, I guess. Um, oh, these, the, uh, the micro chests. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Yeah. Although, they, <laughs> this is where we look back at the last two episodes, and they were there yesterday, we just didn't know <laughs> <realize. laughs> it. was oblivious. oblivious, yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't be uh. surprised. Yeah, oh, I have to make some of these. Ooh, all right, game. If you want, if you want these, I'll make these. I'm just making the need to make all these different types of pipes, like mechanical pipes and pressurized tubes and all of this garbage and this mechanism quest line. But it's fairly straightforward. What so is you're doing? Are you, you you're not working on the on the jetpacks? On the jetpacks. We're not going to wait for it to be night, man. To get some, oh, to get I some zombie see. juice. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. This makes sense. Yeah, yeah. I can't be. Can't, can't venture out in broad daylight, um, mm. but yeah, yeah. The the rest of the provisions are there to make them. It's just the the leather. I'm just busy That's... creating creating lag. Is all. Oh right, nice. Yeah, nice. Don't... <laughs> As you don't, do. Don't, don't worry about me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. All right. <laughs> oh, this view that I'm currently uh, currently looking at, man. There's there's one or two items in my uh, in my vicinity. Right. One or two. Just one or two. Or three or ten. Not many. Not, not, not many. many. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. I would yeah. use the word ample. 
to describe oh, yeah. the number of items around me. Uh, right. Yeah. It's a good description. Yeah. To be fair. Um, uh, <laughs> there's a lot of stuff. <laughs> I uh, I am oh. looking forward to seeing these. Here we go. Let me just. Do I need to? Oh yes, I do. I need to pulverize some diamonds. There we go. Right. What's women. the What's the time on What's the time, Mister Wolf? Hope that's Wolf. not copyright. Uh, what is it we're looking for? I want I want the night. Isaac. Oh, I see. That's what I want. Yeah. Um, where's the sun? It's like bang in the middle of the sky, right? I, I'll continue with these quests. Here we go. Pipes. It's just so nice having all these materials just available. It's, it is, It's right. beautiful. It's actually beautiful. Okay, so that's... <laughs> this goes here. Okay, excellent. I got so many items. I love it. Let's have a look. Where are you, Where are you at? Are you over here? Oh, my <laughs> goodness. Jeez. Okay, I'm going back inside. <laughs> I pretend I didn't see that. <laughs> in fact, I'm, I'm now inside at my crafting table and I can just see like the tops of these items hovering above a pipe <laughs> through the window. Could you bring oh. me um, a, 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 a could be better? A, a, sorry, that'll do chest or, or four? Uh, yes. Let me, here you go. That'll do chest. Here's, uh, here's a couple to, to get you started. Yeah, just stick them down locally, but not too locally so you don't pick the stuff up. Yeah. That's go. fine. Yeah, actually. Yeah. Do, 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 do. things will start despawning if I'm not... Yeah, there's not also some... Rapid. Uh, yeah, let's... Do you need any more? Do you need any more? Uh, no, no, the chest should Okay, be fine. cool, cool. That's perfect. Uh, so I need to make these reinforced alloys. Okay, I got 60, 60 emeralds, Nick. 60 emeralds. I need 256 oh, nice. emeralds. For the singularity, <laughs> For the right. singularity, yeah. I see. How many, jet, how many emeralds do we need for two jetpacks? Uh, we need uh, eight plus... Oh, Christ. Uh, okay, so two... Uh, six... Uh, six, twelve, eighteen... Uh, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. We need 28 emeralds per jetpack, Isaac. Right. So 56 for two? 56 for two, right. I think. So we, we based on the amount that you have acquired. Like we have enough to make we do. the jetpack, but not enough yes. to make the singularity. Mm. Exactly. So, so the question is, uh, how... Cool. I've got two questions for you, Nick. Mm. How much do we want to annoy the YouTube comments? Mm -hmm. And secondly, can we be held responsible if somebody gets like an aneurysm watching us waste 56 emeralds, emeralds on, on two, jet two jetpacks instead of making the singularity? Like, can we legally are we okay on that one? I mean, it's not like we have 256 emeralds and we're using 60 mm. on jetpacks, right? We, we, we're not, we're, we're barely a quarter of the way of getting the singularity the number of uh, emeralds required for a singularity right Correct. so i think it's fine right not gonna lie um, nick thinks it's fine what else are emeralds even used for who knows man Villages? yeah yeah see they can get out here man they're all at home for christmas like true. they don't Very they true. don't care well now i've got 110 emeralds nick right that's okay okay now now you're starting to play with the um, with the odds a little bit, because well, you're you're almost halfway there, you're like forty percent, right? Yeah, which is hmm, that's a little bit more kind of hmm. So it's, like, it's, it's more of a legal grey area in terms of our yeah, culpability, right? Like mm. it could go either way. Yeah, the jury could swing either either side on that one. Yeah. Um, well, it's not going to take that much more gravel, but I'm real quick. I'm going to replace because right now we're using a, a could be better gravel singularity resource generator. If I replace this with a that'll do, and I replace the hopper here, I think we can start pumping gravel out faster, at which point I can probably get this show on the road, you know, fairly quickly. Okay, cool, cool. That is very good, very good. Yeah. Um, I'm going to upgrade this enrichment chamber to a purification chamber, strictly because the game wants me to, and it's still not the evening. So let's do that. Uh, that is also, like shockingly easy to do given our resources how uh, how do you feel about board games man i 
I actually played a board game for the first time in absolutely ages recently. Oh, nice. um, it was one that I've never played before. It was called Articulate. Ooh, Isaac, what's you the, ever heard of Articulate? Premise? I, I can't say I have. Enlighten me as the premise of Articulate. Mm -hmm. So basically, there is a uh, circular shaped board, uh, hence making this a board game. Mm -hmm. um, and it's split into um, about, I'd say, 20 multicolored wedges, uh, like a pizza. And each wedge um, has a, uh, like a category, right? So, uh, like people or um, like places or actions and things like that. Um, and then there's a deck of cards and um, the deck of cards um kind of go around each player so there's just one deck and each player in turn takes the deck of cards um picks one up and depending on there's also two playing pieces uh for either one v1 or just teams so i was on team a and let's say they've got team b we both have a, a game piece you put that at the very beginning of the board where it says start um and that start has a color and a category corresponding to it um, the team that starts then picks up a card. They on the card is about um, six different things. Could be anything, uh, but they have to be matched the categories. So like people, places, uh, actions, things like that. Um, and the player whose turn it is must um, articulate to their team what the word is on the card without actually saying the word. And they can't move like do any hand movements or anything like that. So let's say that um, it was our team's turn and it was my turn within our team uh, to to pick a card. Um, I would pick one. And let's say it said, like, I don't know, like Minecraft. So I'd yeah. have to say a uh, cube-based game that started on Windows that was invented by uh, the person known as Notch, right? Mm -hmm. And then they would say, oh, Minecraft. And then I would put that card down and then immediately pick another card. Um, and then that, if that would have another thing on it, and I would we would go through, and then within forty five seconds, I would have to name as many right. things as possible. And yeah. the number of things that my team gets right is the number of um, spaces we jump forward on the game board. And um, when we jump forward, we might then land on a different category, like um, let's say actions. And then when we when it's the next person's turn on our team, they will only have they can only read the action section of the cards. Um, Within the split, so it's quite fun, man. Yeah, um, actually, like, I, I played a similar game recently. I quite like board games, and I'll, you know, I'll, I'll I'll host a board game night every now and again. Yeah, we played um, a similar one, which was, I guess, you know, if we're going to play semantics, it's not a board game; it's like a more of a card game. Although there is a little bit of a board involved, you know. Yeah, but still, yeah. there's um, yeah, this one's called um, uh, it's by the creators, I believe, of Exploding Kittens. It's called Poetry for Neanderthals, and it's like the same premise as you just said, but you can only use one syllable words. So you pick right. up a card and you have to get your teammates to guess the word on the card, but you can only use one syllable words to describe oh, that. Right? So okay. you say Minecraft, you can say cube game made by notch, right? But like, it, yeah. obviously that's, that's an easier one, but like you can't, you gotta, and then the opposing team gets uh, this <laughs> big old inflatable, um, like caveman stick. And the idea is if somebody, <laughs> if somebody, if you somebody, <laughs> if somebody uses more than a one syllable word, the opposing team gets to hit you with the stick, and then oh, you, uh, that's you lose lit, the point. Actually. Yeah, yeah, I quite it's like a, that. It's a fun time, man. Oh no, that a club like a fun is that is the word I'm looking for. Oh yeah, yeah a caveman yeah, stick. Yeah. Cave <laughs> no, no, I prefer caveman stick. Isaac. Yeah, as do I. That's as do what, I. What, uh, that's way more descriptive of the actual item as opposed to club. Yeah, yeah. Someone yeah, says exactly, oh, I'm going right. to give you a clubbing. I'm going to be like, oh right, I'll get I'll get ready for pre drinks at nine p.m. And then they turn up and hit me, man. I'm going to be so I'm going to feel so cheated, right? Like, exactly, come on. Man, Exactly. But caveman stick, I know exactly what I'm in for. You know for. exactly what you're in for. Yeah, yeah, no, so that's a good time. Um, what else did we play? We also played, uh, the, I, I quite like the uh, the social deduction games. I don't know if you've played any of these, like, um, secret Hitler style games. Stuff like Among Us is like a social deduction game, right? Where mm. somebody is the bad guy, right? But they've got to blend in, right? And, yeah. Um, secret yeah. Hitler is a similar game to that. Where, and I'm, I'm going to stop saying the name of that game because otherwise YouTube's probably going to demonetize me. <laughs> yeah, but, um, yeah. But uh, that's a fun one. There's one called Chameleon that we played recently, which is like you, everyone gets a a card, like a key card, right? Key being like a uh, deciphering kind of key. Right, you know I mean? right, right. So there's like a little uh, grid, a five by five grid of words that gets placed down, right? 
And along the top, it'll say like A, B, C, D, E, and down my left, it'll be like one, two, three, four, five, right? So there's a grid right. of words. And then everyone gets a card, like a key card to decipher some uh, a dice roll. So you roll the dice and the dice will be like B, six, right? And so everyone looks at their card, looks at which, look like looks at B6, and that'll tell you where on the board which word you're looking at, right? But one right. of the people playing doesn't have a key card. Their card just says you're the chameleon. So they don't know what word everyone else is looking at. Right? Oh, so the, okay. They have like a bunch of different cards that do different categories of stuff. So it might be like foods, right? And on the board, it'll say like chicken, cheese, beef, halloumi, whatever it is, right? And then everyone will know the word apart from the chameleon. And then right. you have a few minutes to think of a word. And what you have to do is you have to go around the table and everyone has to say one word related to the word that is on the card, right? But obviously the chameleon doesn't know the word, so they have to try and figure it out from everybody else's word, like on the fly, right? And have to try and think mm -hmm. of a word to say that makes everybody else think they know the word, right? Yeah, I've played a very similar game to this, but um, like a mobile app version. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we all kind of uh, got the same app, created a group, started a game, and then um, let's say there were six of us. Yeah. Five of us were told the word, and then the sixth person, and then had a list of all of the potential words, and yeah. all the players actually had this, However, the imposter did not know which word the other five players had. Yeah. And each person has to go around and ask someone of their choice a question mm. um, to try and see if they know the word or not. But you've got to ask your question quite tactically yeah. so as not to give away what the word actually is. Yeah, because there, there was an extra wrinkle to this game, and that is that even if you figure out who the chameleon is, if they guess the word, they win. Right? Yes, exactly. Yeah. So you've got yeah, to yeah. not you've got to get figure out who it is and convince everybody else it's not you without giving away the word too much, otherwise they still they still get the points. Yeah, so yeah it's exactly. a good time. Yeah, it no, is that's a really good Tremendously point. difficult though, if you are the chameleon and you have to go first. Like you have to yeah. give a word before oh. anybody else. You've which I didn't no have to do. Clue. Not a clue. You just have to pick a word that's so like <laughs> there were a bunch of movies. Um like there were a bunch of, uh, I had one, and they were like science fiction movies, right? So there's like Star Wars on there, mm -hmm. there's like The Martian on there, uh, there's like all these things. And I'm going first, and I'm the chameleon, I've got no bloody clue what word it is. Oh, so I just, no. I just said like, special effects or something like that, right? Right. And, like, and you know, first people were like, oh, maybe, and then afterwards, they, you know, obviously they get to like a deliberation stage, and everyone's like, that's like a really vague, like every single, <laughs> that applies to every single movie on this board. I was yeah. like, it seems like you don't know what word we're talking about. <laughs> Yeah, and they they oh, didn't get like one, that. Unfortunately. Oh dear. Yeah. See, that's that is that is very unlucky. Um, yeah, it is. Like it's, you got done dirty there, man. Less than ideal, man. Yeah. Yeah, for sure, for sure. No, that's that's really good. Yeah. Mm. Um, oh, and then uh, I do have one more board game as well. Oh, go on. Recently, it's called Confident, right? Oh, and yeah. uh, this one, everyone gets a little a little whiteboard, and there's a deck of cards that is uh, drawn from, and the card will have like a prompt on it, and the prompt will right. be. The point will be a question that you have to give an answer to in the form of a range, right? So it'll be like, what percentage of UK adults have tattoos, right? Right. And so on your board, you could put something like, I think between 26 and 51% of UK adults have tattoos, right? And yeah. then everyone puts this down, everyone reveals what they thought, and then the answer is revealed. The person who has the smallest range that is correct gets three points. And the, uh, if you get the answer correct, but your range is not the smallest, you get one point. If your answer is not in the range, you get zero points, right? Right. So you've got to try and pick like the smallest range possible that still has the correct answer in it to get the most points. I see. Oh, that's quite interesting because you, you've you've if you you've got to kind of um, cut, almost balance between mm. being correct. Yep. Like it, the answer being within your range, but yep. also having a higher score yeah, than yeah, everyone yeah. else. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And sometimes it's like with the tattoo thing, it's like I've got no idea what percentage of UK adults have tattoos, right? Yeah. Um, so you can kind of take a bit of a guess. But other times it's a bit closer. It's like, you know, uh, how many episodes of Friends were there in total? And it's like, oh, you know, I know there are 10 seasons and there's like 22 episodes a season. And so at that point, you're kind of calculating in your head, like, is it, you know, and like how close do I want to get with this? How tight do I want to make it? Am I confident that there's 22 episodes in every season? Like, yeah. it's, um, it's a good time, man. No, that's, yeah, that's good. People are so clever with board games. Yeah, I always do yeah. think this. I'm like, how did you come up with this? Yeah. Like, it's always, like, so impressive. I'm like, these are, I always think, like, oh, these are such good ideas, right? Yeah, yeah. So, and, and people just, you know, seem to come up with them. I guess it's uh, such as such is history. Mm -hmm. um, people question, just... question for you, Nick. Yeah. Uh, how many pork sausage rolls 
the Greg Salpo week in the UK? Oh, I feel like I've come across this uh, in the past as well. Um, per week, Greg Sausage Rolls. Um, give, give me a range. Between 100 and 400,000. Nick, you are in the exact same range I was in, and it is way too low. They really? sell 2.5 million Greg's Sausage Rolls per week oh in the UK. Oh, my God. Yeah, I know. That is ridiculous. <laughs> it's staggering. That is... That it's is... actually insane. That doesn't include the vegan ones, just the pork ones. I don't think people realise, um, like, how bad those are for you. Yeah. Because they're so small. <laughs> I always clock this whenever I go to Greg's and get a sausage roll. They're so small, but they're so tasty. Mm -hmm. And then you look at the nutritional info. Yeah. And you then realise why they are so tasty. Yeah. Because they are absolutely Filled with just like it's just like all fat, all salt. saturated fat, and yeah, salt. yeah, fat, and just general like <laughs> yeah, the man, the things that are just not meant to be consumed in high quantities. Mm -hmm. So that is what like um, one in there thirty are, per capita. That's what I'm saying. There are only sixty million people in the UK, man. So selling two point five million a week is staggering. That's wild. <laughs> That is so wild. Yeah. yeah it's incredible. Yeah, we is, all, we uh... all know about that one. I was like, I put like 300 to 600,000 was my guess, but yeah, it was. Yeah. Um, I, I'd love to see the concentration of that on like a map of the UK. <laughs> I bet you like a significant the, amount. The I bet you it was all just up north. Yeah. It has to Greg's be right. such a northern thing as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's, uh, that's something then, eh? I want to see the Jeez. distribution as well between four pecks and one pecks. Yeah. Oh God, I forget you could get a four pack. You know. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Like I, I, I think if oh, just there must be such a significant proportion of people getting four packs and just munching them <laughs> Maybe, <laughs> to yeah. themselves. It's like me with twenty that. nuggets at McDonald's, man. I get them. It's like share box. I'm like, yeah, sharing from between myself, 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 and myself. <laughs> oh dear, that is uh, that is that is quite something. Um, <laughs> yeah, although I haven't um, had a sausage roll in ages, I actually. can't remember the last time I had a Greg sausage roll. Man, it's been a while. Yeah, it's been a while. I should go and have one. I think. Yeah, no, I've definitely had number, one. Then, you know, pardon. Add to that number. You know? Yeah, exactly. Get up to three million a week. You know. Yeah, I mean, I reckon I can do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it, we can make it happen. We can make it happen. Hundred percent, man. Hundred percent. We go. You and I put our heads together and and starting in two hundred fifty six thousand sausage rolls each a week. Like we can do it. We can do. It. I think we'll have to monetize it as well, though, right? All oh, right. Yeah. We'll have to be like uh, Nick and I. These two two idiots eat one million sausage rolls <laughs> in the space of a week. I don't think it would be a very long term plan. Yeah, I think um, you just might actually remove the video, man, for like you know just danger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, se severe negligence or yeah, something exactly, like that. Man. Uh, well, as long as although as long as we say don't try this at home, Isaac, mm. that's all you need these days, man. Maybe. Honestly, I don't know. I'm it's like you. um, it's like Guinness, you know, the the world record book. They took out all of like the, you know, challenges that actually like harm oh, like people. potentially dangerous. Yeah, yeah like eat as much yeah. as you can in a in a set period of time. Like all that stuff's you know gone now. So. Yeah, it's um, or like it's longest time right? without urinating. Like they took that stuff out yeah, when people start to, <laughs> start to die. Yeah. You know, I watched so. a video about this quite recently, mm. and it's like, yes, here are all these crazy things that people uh, that that got removed so that people don't try and break them yeah, because it's yeah, just yeah, such yeah. a high danger. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Um, but I think in within that same video, they talked about how what the the primary ones. So it's quite um. Uh, appropriate for this topic one of the ones that they did leave in that does technically sort of fall into that category is the eating challenges yeah um, oh, I, th well, man, I think they left those ones in I'm not 100% though um, I think they left in the timed eating challenges so right. it's like how many you know hot dogs can you eat in for 15 minutes yeah but they, they removed yeah. the ones that's like how many hot dogs can you eat in one sitting or whatever right like they exactly yeah exactly yeah because um, it was especially the water one as well right the water ones were like quite dangerous to yeah to peeps uh near and far um there's that famous case like when the wee came out <laughs> of someone who tried to drink what like it's like how much water can you drink in x amount of time and this woman did it and then she just got like completely waterlogged and and died as a result of this like competition yeah. so i think that was like a big turning point Mm -hmm. um but yeah because personally man i would uh i would not want to drink that much water or in fact consume 
that much of any kind of 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 substance mm. in that quantity um apart from i don't know if i'm like really hungry and there's like a nice burger in front of me then i could be could be obliged but That's most of the it. time most of the time it's a no um <clears throat> what am i missing here buh, buh, buh. I'm on diamonds now, Isaac. Diamond tier jetpacks. Nick, I have the singularity resource generator set up with the emerald quantum oh, singularity. Oh, brilliant, brilliant. Okay, excellent. Let me make the a emerald few more. one is is slow though. Even with a that'll do, you only get eight items per second, which oh, you know, wow. compared to something like gravel. With the gravel one, you get 174 blocks per second. So they've really you know toned it down for for emerald, but still. And I even see. with diamond, diamond. Oh, diamonds also eight. Interesting. Oh, that's do this here we go so let's whack over these two thrusters okay cool yeah i do have them now right downstairs is it i'm assuming this uh these emerald ones ah, it yeah, is. yeah. we've it got is. more than enough now we've got like a few hundred i think again Excellent. they're in the system man you don't even need to go down oh yeah of course. everything's just connected yeah, it's yeah. Just have, you been, have you been, have yeah, you been yeah. dipping up and down man like... no no i haven't actually <laughs> i've just, just for the emeralds uh luckily here we go right so i need uh three six of these uh eight of these batteries which means i need like quite a few of these 10 11, 12 let's go with like 16 all right let's make four thrusters actually we need to make a few of these two three four five six seven eight i think it's 10 batteries we need and then all we right. do two of these and we do four of these. Uh, I have need of a chad. More of these coils. Let's go with five. All right. Here we go. Emerald jetpacks on tap. Nice. Isaac, let's do... Some... Are you a way of charging them? Uh, I have not thought that far ahead. Um, right. What is the uh, the most, I guess, appropriate method given there our current is situation? The energetic infuser mm. that can from uh, thermal that can work. Okay, let's make one of those. Yeah, the, that should do the, the, classic, the classic, the classic, the classic. Uh, although, is it is it called something else? Uh, no, the energetic infuser. Energetic. Uh, energetic. Infuse. Oh. At yeah. Thermal. It's not air, man. Do we? Has thermal been kneecapped? Ooh. Oh, am I losing my mind? Pulverizer. It's just not there. It's just not there. It's just been, it's just been sucked out. Oh, my goodness oh me. My. Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, no. Uh... Um... God, it's like I got the new iPhone, I mean, Isaac. It's there in my hands. I've got no bloody way to charge it. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> you might be able to put them, like, maybe straight into the A2 charger. I actually don't know if that works. The one that's oh, the metal edge confuser. Give like, it a go, right? It's like, I think you know, it legit might work. No, it's, it, ain't, it, ain't, uh, it ain't going in there. Oh! You put it, it on your back. You put it on your back. Oh. Oh, I see. Right. That's uh, that's quite interesting. Right. Um. Okay. Plan B. Oh yeah, a mechanism energy cell will do. So actually, that's just in the roof here, just up in the roof. Oh sweet, right above you. I like, just put it in the uh, negative slot. Oh yeah, here we go. Negative, negative slot. Yeah. That's the one. Yeah. Does hold forty-eight million Fe though, so it might take a, a hot minute there to to fill up. Yeah. Are you? Yeah, it's the positive slot. It is the positive oh, slot? Yeah. Never mind, yeah, my bad. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that's that's sucking the juice out of that cube. Nice. That Nick, is very much. Uh, are you hungry right now? Do you have do you have hunger legs available? I I have saturation legs available, but not hunger legs available. Can you still eat on saturation legs? I don't think so. But either okay. way, Nick, here's if we can gluttony charm. Boom. Ooh, hello. Instant, instant eating from now on, man. That in a bauble slot? Can I? Put oh, some I don't think you slot? can. We'd have is to. Is it because of the sleep charm? I it is. That yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh. That's fine. Do you just need you to keep it up somewhere? Could I, yeah, could I have mine back, please? Yeah, there you go. Thank you. Yeah, just anywhere in your inventory is 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 fine. Okay, cool. That's that's all good. Okay, sweet. Uh, <laughs> is this done? Oh Christ! Yeah, that's that really has almost emptied this bloody cube. All right, and it's, it's only got six out of forty-eight million. Right, let's put that's the other one. That's what I was saying. Yeah, it's um, 
It's a lot of juice, man. It's just all going to go offline now. No, it's all right. It's uh, self-sustaining. Yeah, I think it's a separate power line. Oh. Like, I think the power is split because up on the surface, we have multiple, like, power generating devices. I'm also, I'm building us a little chute for the roof. Here oh, we go. cool, cool. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Hopefully yeah. So you won't see, need that chute for long. You'll see that this wind turbine is powering this cell. Over here, this wind turbine and this solar generator are powering everything else. Right. Okay, that's good. Well, here you go, man. Uh, it's not it's not massively charged, but it's got a big battery, so hopefully it should carry you <laughs> somewhat the uh, the way. Oh. oh, yeah. Okay, so uh, G turns hover on and off, and then uh, I think it's normally V that turns engine on and off, but let's have a look. Jet. Okay, uh, I'll go get mine. It is V, but V is otherwise predisposed. Right. Let's put this. There we go. Oh yeah, this thing is this thing is quick, man. So it's V V, is it? Did you say? Yeah. Uh, well, are you ready for this, man? Are you watching me? You're watching. I'm watching. Holy moly! It's it's quick. That is wild. It is fast. <laughs> that is wild. Oh my goodness! Is it? Is yeah, it yeah. Like so you gotta go options controls and then type in V and then tick the key box. Uh, ah, and then clear everything that's not toggle engine. Uh, cool. Let's clear that. Is that escape? Oh, yeah, escape. There we go. All right, toggle engine. Oh my! Oh my goodness me! Yeah, that, yeah and that's... if you press G, you can turn hover mode on, which means you basically just don't fall. It's like creative oh, hover. Yeah, it's yeah a bit look like at that, flight, isn't it? Yeah. This so, is wild. <laughs> you can use uh, comma and period to change the throttle oh, if it's I too fast. I was about this. Yeah. yeah. So if you go comma and bring it out like 60, and then, you know, G and fly around, it, it's a little less. Yeah, and I'm assuming it uses a, a much less. I think it uses like 40% less. Whatever the throttle is, I assume yeah. it uses that percentage oh, I less. I think if I, if I actually empty run it, out. I, yeah. have, I have indeed. It, indeed uh, it, it does use 880 FE per tick. Right, so a lot. <laughs> <laughs> just, a, just a small, wee little just amount. A small little yeah. chunk of FE. I mean, even twenty um, percent is fast enough for the current size of our area, right? Unless we like go exploring, twenty yeah. percent is pretty adequate to stop like the viewers going crazy as well. <laughs> like, the, the extreme speeds. Yeah, I mean, the problem that we might now run into, though, Nick, and that we're going to have to deal with fairly soon, I think is that in total, we are producing, like, maybe 200 FE per tick up here, right? Right. So, like, the, producing... like literally, our jetpacks are, are solely each su surpassing the uh, generation speeds of these. Yeah, well, the wind turbines do 66 each. That's 120 between them. And then the, the solar panel here is kind of flickering up to, like, 100-ish, but it does it kind of intermittently. And right. so... Yeah, like we're doing about 200 FE, and us two combined, we're using like 1,600 if we keep the jetpacks, like for every, you know, second or every tick that we use right. the jetpack. Every tick is 1,600 FE that we're using. <sighs> so it's it's a lot, man. It's a lot. Yeah, that's, that's, that, that is uh, just but a tad. I can now do this to very quickly get it up to the up top of the, the tank. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Is that, uh, how tall are we at now? Is that 32? I think this is 19. I don't think it's okay. that tall, man. Like, I go from Y level 72 up to 93. Okay. So, so it's like 21. 21. Okay. Yeah. So, so 11, 11, 11 higher on that. Yeah. 11 times 3 is what? 33? 11 uh, times yes. 9 is what we need, though, right? It's actually 99. Okay. 99 blocks of copper, is it? Yeah, 99. No, no, just tank blocks is, is what we oh, need, okay. which are not blocks of copper. Okay. Yeah. Alas, though, Nick, we are out of time for mm. this episode. Uh, but we got some good progress, Nick. We got the Emerald Singularity now, which is fantastic. Mm -hmm. uh, we could potentially look at upgrading our furnaces downstairs to Emerald Furnaces, making those even faster yes. if we wanted to. Um, and yeah, I think next time, Nick, uh, we I did set up over in here a fluid extractor. So if you ever want to dump your fluid, man, like just stay in here. This will extract oh, it for you. Oh, nice, nice. But uh, it makes latex. We can use that to get uh, into industrial fog going. So maybe next time we can also look at getting uh, some kind of mob farm, potentially, up and running, something like that. Uh, also, again, just power in general is something we could look at, at working on, right? Um, yeah, I assume yeah. we could look at maybe getting like a uranium singularity. Like we do have a lot of uranium, I think, over in these mm. uh, chests from all the sifting I've been doing. And 
if we get a uranium singularity, we could then look at getting like um, a nuclear reactor from power. That's P O W A H power, mm, mm-hmm. and, uh, and using that to get us a good amount of power, P O W E R, for our for our base and all of our you know jetpacky needs, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. And then we'll be flying literally, Isaac, mm. all mm. of the time. Mm.